WDSU. First at five, the WDSU I team has confirmed the Smoothie King Center is facing major security concerns tonight, and it's tied to the officer shortage at the NOPD. The revelations come as the New Orleans Pelicans prepare to take on the Utah Jazz tonight. WDSU I team reporter Travers Mackel has this breaking story you'll see only on six. What have you uncovered, Travers? Scott, the general manager of the Superdome and Smoothie King Center confirms that he had to scramble last week to find enough law enforcement officers to provide adequate security at the last Pelicans game and due to a shortage of cops in New Orleans and the NOPD using an all-hands-on-deck approach for carnival parades, Jefferson Parish Sheriff's deputies were used last Saturday and that will continue in the future. Alan Freeman also says SMG, or Sports Management Group, the company that runs the Dome and Arena, used about a dozen JPSO deputies to provide security at the, at the arena last Saturday night for the Bulls game. Freeman also says JPSO deputies will be contracted to work tonight's game and Wednesday night's game at the arena. Once again, about a dozen deputies both nights. Freeman says SMG asked for and received permission from the city last week to go outside New Orleans to find officers to work the basketball games. He says 60 officers are used inside and outside the arena on game nights and admits that goal was not met Saturday, but adds that the arena did meet the number, required, the number of required officers the NBA demands. The Police Association of New Orleans is not happy with this agreement and says it now has new questions as to how the city and Office of Police Secondary Employment will staff regular details at restaurants and businesses in the city. The general manager of the arena says he does not plan to use JPSO deputies after Mardi Gras is over. He also says it's the first time JPSO deputies have been used to replace NOPD officers at the arena due to staffing issues. Scott.